Okay, there it is. There it is. Look. <coughs> I got a frog in my throat right away. So let me see now how long it takes for my thing to start over here. Everybody see me? Everybody see me? There it is. Oh, got to skip the ad. Hang on a second. You know what I got to do. I got to skip the ad. Oh, there it went. It skipped. Now that, okay. Oh, it's my glasses. I'm looking at my screen over there. <laughs> and I'm thinking it's all blurry, but it's my glasses. Oh, okay. Let's do some show and tell first. Um, first, I want to say thank you to everybody who came to the Toy Masters collaboration today. Well, Toy Masters Fluid Art collaboration. I was so honored to be part of that. I had so much fun. Yes, I'm the newbie in the group over there. This is my first collab with them. But um, I just wanted to... Um, oh, you are lurking. Okay. Yes, it was fun, 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 Joy. Yes, it was. And Roxanne, thank you. So first, let me say hello to my usual suspects. I see Shannon, I see Mo, I saw Christina, I saw Moose, and I think Shelly's in there too. So let's give it up for my moderators. Woohoo! My mods of awesomeness. And there's a lot of people in the chat, so I'm just going to say hello to my viewers of awesomeness. You guys rock too. I, I, I wouldn't do this without you guys. So, first, um, first I'm going to show you what I should have showed you last week, but I forgot. So, let's look at... Oh, uh, I don't know what the... Uh, my lighting isn't all that great, it doesn't look like. But this is the... Magic wand pour I did a couple weeks ago. And I'm loving how it turned out. I love those little cells right there. Those are cute. That was the magic wand. Now, let me get out the heart that I did. I'm trying to remember how I did it. Um... I can't remember. Oh, colander. Upside down colander pour. That's what it was. And it doesn't look like a per two people in the middle anymore. It looks more like um, two, two ducks or two swans looking up at the sky. So they could be lovebirds. But I'm loving the details I got in this. Okay, I'm looking to see. That shit stick. Excuse my language, people, but I was just reading what Brian typed. Okay, that was the heart. Okay, now, let me start with the one that I, that just, the, the colors just got ate up by the black. This was the, one of the ones I did. Okay. Hi, 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 everybody. Um, this was the one of the first, I think this, this was the first one I did. And I, I know why it got ate up, why the black ate up the colors, because I blew too hard into the base coat and kind of brought up too much base coat. So that was one of them. Okay, where, where can I put that at? And then this one was the other one. Let me turn it this way, I think is where, where it'll look best. It's got a pretty shine to it. Well, hello, Miss Jan. And 
Um, I'm looking to see um, what else what people are saying. This one I, I like. It, it looks dark, I think. My, my computer screen looks darker. And then this one, this one I am over the moon with. Not my normal colors, but I am over the moon. I especially like this right here. Look at those little cells I got. That was uh, probably the white and the uh, yellow, which was the benza my my da my dazzling, or I forgot how to pronounce it. The Benz yellow. How's that? <laughs> I ain't the only person on the in our art community that can pronounce it right is Karen from Waterfall Acrylics. So this one I'm very, very happy with. Okay, so got a surprise for y'all tonight. I'm giving away two paintings, not one, but two. And what, what it's gonna be is it's, it's gonna be buyer pay shipping and you get to pick from one of those or one of the ones I do with a white background, okay? The first winner gets their first pick, and then when I draw another number, they'll get to, uh, they'll get to pick what's, from what's left. So what I'm doing is, is I'm doing, let me put just a little bit down to act as a suction cup, and now these canvases, they're good, except they got, um, what they got is, is they got some little black marks that were left by staples, but I think the paint will cover it up. See, I'm using those canvases, Jan. <laughs> okay, let me, okay. So, there is my little base coat. Now it's thicker. What I've been noticing with Zaw is, um, colored, colored me, colored, color me Zaw. Um, who is anti-tape? I'm not anti-tape. Okay, um, what I notice with him is when he does these, he has a pretty thick, um, um, not only a puddle in the middle, but it's also thicker in consistency. So, I'm going to put some, now these are, this is just my glue and water pouring medium with the Michaels, um, um, yeah, two paintings tonight, buyer, I mean, buyer, winter pay shipping, okay, now these are all golden fluid acrylics that I'll be using, they are mixed with my Michaels Craft Smart glue pouring medium, which is 60% glue, 40% water, I put about two ounces in the cup, and because these are golden fluid acrylics, I hardly had to put any paint in there. He's just bossy. Okay, yeah, he is bossy, isn't he, Linda? Okay, so, I shook that one up. Let me give it some yellow. Uh, I love these little, um, I forgot what... I think they're called Boston Tops, um, but I like this on there. Okay, let me put that one there. Uh, I think I'm going to put some manganese blue. Canvases from where? The canvases were from Artistro, okay? Kathy, and what had happened was is they did not put the... Um, plastic or anything in between them and they also put the staple part against the um against the front of the canvas next to it and that's how I got little marks right there but I have used some of them okay that was manganese blue U still all golden fluid acrylics Okay, I'm going to do some cadmium red medium. Yeah, it was terrible, Joy. They just, you know, 
they tried to say at first it wasn't their canvases, but I beg to differ, it was. Okay, that was a cadmium, cat, cat, cadmium red medium U. Okay, let me, I'm going to put some of this, uh, okay, who was that, who was that? Oh, okay. Um, 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 Christina's, uh, Christina, um, Shannon and Shelly both have the link for it. Um, so, um, okay, that is the Benz, Benz my Dazzle Oni Yellow. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't pronounce these things right. And let me see. I think I'm going to put some phthalo blue on there. Oh, hello, Virginia. I am doing three paintings. I'm going to use my Catalyst Wedge, but I'm thinking of trying out these. I showed them last week, trying one of these out in one of them. Okay, this is phthalo blue green shade. Okay, and now I'm going to put some iridescent bright gold around it. Yeah, they were just as bad, um, um, Jan. Okay, that is the uh, iridescent bright gold by Golden. And just to give it a little bit of pop, I'm going to put a little bit of carbon black in there. I got yellow in there, so hopefully it doesn't make baby poop green, but we will find out together. Okay. I'm going to blow it out like I've seen Zaw do. This is the Berta hair dryer. Approach it from Christina Welch Art. Put a um, zip tie to hold the cool button in so you don't have to keep holding it. Now I'm going to be putting it on high because these are pretty thick paints. So turn down your volume because here comes the hair dryer. Okay, I got a little bit too deep. want to blow your paints across it like you do in the blooms but I still got a little bit too deep okay I'm just doing this to get it to spread out and hopefully cover the sides and it did Wait a minute. Okay, I don't know what the joke was. Pro a tip. I don't know. Okay, um. Well, I know you like it like that, Christina, but the whole point of this is to put my little swirls in there like Zaw does it. So, okay. Okay, I see something here. Okay. I need to put just a little bit of white right there. And I'm going to pull a Mona. I'm going to put some on my finger and dab it there. Just like I saw Mona do in her video today. So for those of you that didn't see that collaboration today, um, um, you need to go back. If you go, go on my page... No, I, I don't, I don't want to leave it. 
Okay, I'm going to do one swirl from one corner to the other, okay? So, let me go across like, oops, can't have the break on it either because of where it's at. So, up. Well, that's, I mean, that added some interest. I might have blown, I might have spun a lot of the paint off. Okay, I'm going to use the short end. Okay, I don't know what that is right there. Okay, I need something to take it out with. Uh, I have no idea what I just did there. It's a drop. I dripped somehow. Okay. I'm going to do one more little one right here. And now, I'm going to call this done. I dripped. Well, yeah, I see that, but let me see. Let me see what I can do cuz it's right in where some blues at. Well, that kind of got rid of most of it. Nope, nope. I still see a little bit. Making sure that I got paint down all the sides. Okay, time to torch and bring it up for a close-up. Okay, I am missing a little bit of paint right there. corner okay I'll fix it when I lift it I am loving this see don't try to do these catalyst wedges on with black because everything just gets lost on the canvas okay let me just get a little bit right there a little bit right there See, the swirls added some interest. Okay, missing a little bit of paint right there. I am loving this, this area right here. And I'm loving, wait a minute, so I don't reach across the painting. And I'm loving this area right here. Okay. Up. See, I didn't get some paint down on some of these areas. And it looks like I got everything. Okay, that is painting number one. But the winners do get to pick from even the black ones, too. Ah. I'm having a cup problem, so bear with me, people. There we go. There we go. Got it on the cups. I was having a cup problem. <laughs> no, I don't play sports. I was just having a cup problem. Okay. Let me get something to get rid of the colored paint off of here. Okay, wipe. Yeah, wipe you off as best I can. Okay, let me get canvas number two.
got something stuck had something stuck to the um to the back of my um press and seal okay a little glue to make it stick so it don't spin off okay right in the middle Okay, now I might repeat some of those colors, but Oh, hi cat. Nice to see you. I haven't seen you for a while girlfriend Nice to see you here Okay, I'm gonna put some green gold down I didn't get a chance to mix up the other fluid acrylics I have today, but I have other greens, so we're stuck with the green gold for right now. No, I have tape over the edges of the Preston seal. Okay, this is Payne's Gray. Okay, now, hmm, not going to put a purple. I am going to put some of this thallow blue green shade on there. Okay, now... I want to go with a darker red. There it is. Alzerian Crimson U. Probably going to make purple, but... Okay. And... For Grins and Giggles... You had an M meal. I was going to say, would you have an uh, MRE? Sorry, I, 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 I used to, I used, used to be, have a dad that was in, in the military, and two of my husbands were. Okay, that was the pyro red. <sighs> I'm going to put a little bit more green gold around it and I think I'm gonna put some iridescent pearl on top of it before I put before I'm gonna put the silver on this no no MREs Okay, this is the iridescent silver. Remember, I said these are all um, uh, golden fluid paints. Okay, and let me give it a quick torch. Okay, now I'm going to see how I can blow this out. That's a little bit better in the blowing, I think. Ah. 
Okay, blowing too hard again. So let me just add a little bit of the base coat right here to help pull it over the side. Okay. I'm going to put a little bit right here. Okay, little bit on this corner. Come on, I don't want a lot. Okay, let me give it a spin, baby spin. Okay, I see an area right there that it didn't go, and right there it didn't go. And it looks like it went everywhere else. Now, I'm going to try one of the other tools. I get these at Ace Hardware. I can't remember what section they're in. I think it's where you do your, like, your, um, your, um, stuff you put down. I will what? Okay, so... I'm going to use the big square teeth. Ooh, I like what that did. But I don't want to do... Now, it's like, I don't know if you all remember me saying this last time I did these, but... It's best to do them in threes, and I count that as one. So, there's two. Okay, we'll count that as three, because I want to leave this where, the way it is. Ah. And I'm going to say I'm happy with it. What do you guys think? I'm single-minded about my processes. I know. Well, tonight's process is to do Catalyst Wedge. Ah, I hate this. I hate this when my finger gets stuck. In <laughs> my glove finger gets stuck in the little switch. Okay, let me bring this up. And I can see a paper towel stuck to my glove. I'm just trying to get my hand up under it. Okay. I see a couple of spots it didn't drip all the way down to yet. I like it. See, I know people thought that I should uh, should have just left it the way it was, but that's the whole the whole idea behind what I'm doing is to is to get some interesting little zaw swirls, is what we call them. I like them. Still left some of it. 
Still got those pretty cells right there. So let me put this one down. Trying to not mess up my sides as I put it down on the cup. Ah, come on, cup. I got a stubborn cup that's hiding underneath the painting. Okay, it's giving me fits. It won't come out. Come on, come on. You got to go to the corner. There you go. See, it didn't want to go to the corner. So I'm going to name that cup Brian. <laughs> Although, that could be me after the retreat, I think. Because I may not want to go to the corners either. Just getting rid of the color paint. Okay. One more. Oh, hello, Bonnie, and thank you. Now, it's not wedges. It's just little, um, um, little three-ounce cups underneath them. Okay, let me do one more and then we're going to draw, we're going to draw numbers or let you guys pick numbers. And guess what, Linda? I got the numbers already written down. Hee hee, hee hee. Oh, <laughs> I love you too, Jan. <laughs> You are a super chat superstar, an awesome viewer of awesomeness, and I appreciate you and love you. And I just got a bunch of sweat behind my glasses. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, my lights are on. And they do kick it up. So, oops. Now I got it all over my glasses. But I probably got paint on my glasses too. But oh well. Okay, let's do one more. And I'm going to try one thing. I'm going to put it all the way around. So maybe it'll flow out when I blow it easier. Uh, Don't want that big puddle in the middle. It's not a pillow paint. Well, I guess you could call it a pillow paint. <laughs> okay, so let me give it a torch and hopefully my glove finger doesn't get, my finger on my glove doesn't get stuck in there. Okay, I'm looking at the colors I haven't used yet. Ah, here we go. Here's an old favorite, dioxazine purple. Okay, there's some dioxazine purple. And I think 
I'm going to put a little bit of the carnacridone magenta next to it. I meant to mix up some primary magenta today. Okay, there's some of the magenta. Uh, let me see. Uh, ultramarine blue. That'll go good next to those two colors. Okay. I think what I'm going to... I'm going to try to keep... Come on, close, bottle. I think I'm going to try to keep this... There, yeah, I'm going to put some of the pearl over it. Okay, and I think I'm going to keep this one simpler than the other ones, and I'm just going to put some iridescent gold over it, too, to give it that shimmer. Okay. Oh, uh, Brian's going to be a bad boy, huh? And I hope that, um, I think I had seen it, um, um, oh my God, Brian, I agree with Linda, who knew? Okay, um, oh, let me pop bubbles first. I hope that you guys um, enjoyed today's Toy Master collaboration. I had fun with what I created. I also hope to see you guys next Saturday right after my live at Darnell's um, live or auction. Excuse me. Okay, let's see what I can do here. I didn't blow it too deep. Yay. Okay, let me give it a spin to see if it goes all the way out to the edges. Make sure my sides and corners get covered. Ah. A little bit right there on the corner because I really don't want to spin it anymore after I do some swirls. Okay. Uh, why are you telling me to stop? Okay. Um, I'm going to do the wedge on this one. And what I'm going to do is, is, ah, come on, stop. Okay, I'm going to do that one there. I got to hold it. It won't, it won't stay put. Okay, I like it, let's see what the, because it don't need a wedge, well, well, 
Well, if I had thinner paints, Joy B, it might be a Dutch blow, but. And I might be doing that soon. <laughs> Oops. I might as well switch gloves. You know why? I got a big old hole in this one. So let me, before I put on new gloves, let me torch it real quick. And I do have to put on some gloves. I have to mop my face because I am sweating underneath these lights. I'm going to wipe its little bottom. I'm going to draw no, or have you guys pick numbers. Okay. Baby powder the hands so the gloves go on easier. My hands smell good. What is, um, what is Brian doing? Sorry, Brian, but you is naughty. What's Brian doing? 73. No, I'm not even picking numbers yet or asking for numbers yet. But, see, Brian says that 73 is the Chuck Norris of numbers. Okay, so... Come on, glove. Put baby powder on. I don't know why it's sticking. <laughs> They're making stuff up about you. Are you guys making up stuff about Brian? You know, I will go in there tomorrow and read my chat, Brian, to see what kind of trouble you caused. Hmm. Okay, let me pick this one up. Let me touch a couple little places. I don't know how I got the pearls. I really do not know how I got the pearls. This is, okay, this one I'm going to have to say, it looks a little corny to me. Not my best one, but hey. I love these cells over here. Okay, let me put this one down. Uh, hang on one second. I'm trying to move one of these over a little bit to make room for this one next to it. Okay, that's going to have to stay where it's at. Okay, what I'm going to do is, is, I should have taken my gloves off before I did this, is I'm going to put the number right here. So, gong! Sorry, I hope that wasn't too loud. I am just going to uh, take this off of there. I'm going to put a number there. So, refresh your screens. Make sure you're in live chat. Let me wipe my brow again. Okay. So I can read the chat a little bit better. Okay. 
Let me take a peek in here real quick just to make sure I know which number's in there. Okay. There's a number in there between 1 and 50. The winner is responsible for shipping. I can't ship these out tomorrow. So, um... <sighs> I said gong, okay? <laughs> oh, are you guys... <laughs> you guys sound like you're having fun. Okay. Number between 1 and 50. You will pay... You will, will be responsible for the shipping. Um, to, sometime tomorrow or... Or whenever you get a chance, if I don't know your address, your your home address to ship it to, send me an email at dor to dorisford at yahoo.com. What are you typing, Christine? I can't understand that at all. Oh, you're going to pass on the drawing? Okay, Virginia. Oh, hi, Sherry. Nice to see you. And I saw somebody say hi to Luke. Is there a Luke here, too? Oh, that was Polish. She's telling... <laughs> okay, okay. Let's get back to the drawing. There's a number in here between 1 and 50... You are responsible for the shipping, um, and um, you're, uh, the one who has this number gets first pick, and let me get my little cheat sheet back down so I can see it right next to the, oops, what did I just do? Okay, hang on a second, I just lost my, um, I just lost my um, chat. Okay, what? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, hang on a second. <laughs> I lost my chat on the, um... I lost my chat on there, so hang on a second. I gotta go to my channel on my, uh, on my, um... On my, uh, phone to see the chat because I can't see the chat on my computer now oh. Oh. well okay I'm not going to be on camera I'm going over to the computer over here okay so it's a number between 1 and 50 okay and you're going to get the first pick of the first painting so let's get this drawing on the way uh so on your mark get set go let's see who has the winning number start typing numbers in the chat And we have a winner. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. We have a winner. Let me, let me get over here to, thank you, Shelly. We have a winner. I don't know if I have your address or not, so you're going to have to send me an email. And it is number 12 which what I saw was Joy B. So, Miss Joy B, let me, let me go get the tray. Well, did you want to see the white ones again or did you want to pick one of the black ones? So, let, okay, um, I don't have a tray to put them on. 
Okay, here was one of the black ones. There, there was this one. Let's call this one the black with the yellow. I'll call that one. Well, that's the second black one. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you wanted black or white. So let me bring this tray back over. And then I will stick your name next to the canvas that you want. Or you can pick one of these. Okay, you can pick you can pick this one. We'll call these the white ones. One, two, and three. Okay, so let me come over to the chat over here because I got rid of it on my screen. Okay. Okay, so I'm waiting to see what Joy wants because that one won't be available for the next one. You like the black number two, which was, hang on a second, let me move this again so I can bring it back over just to make sure. Because this one will be ready to ship sooner. Okay, is this the one that you like? Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. Is that the one that you want, Joy? Okay. This is now claimed by Joy. And I'm going to just stick your name on the back of this send me an email honey okay now we got one more number okay we got one more number the only one that can't enter is George well besides uh, some um, let me see who won last week um, I think Shelly I know Shelly won um, Kathy won I can't remember y'all guys just got to be honest Okay, so now we got uh, one more number. Where'd my paper go? There it is. Okay, number between 1 and 50. So go ahead and start. It's a number between 1 and 50. There we go. Now I start seeing numbers. Still don't see the number. Keep going. Keep going. I see people really close to it. Okay, stop, stop, stop. We have a winner. We have a winner. We have a winner. Shannon or Shelly will go up and verify, but the winning number is number 36. So guess who's going to get this painting? I don't care how naughty he was, but that was the first 36 I saw in the chat. So you can pick your painting in a second. Let me just go back up real quick. I'm almost positive it was Brian. Oh, Darnell, you were close. I'm going through the chat. Okay, I see him right below Moose Crazy 16 and right above Kelly Manx 40. And hi, Kelly. So was I right? Yeah, there we go. 453. So, 
did you want to did you want one of the black ones that's left or do you want to take a look at the white ones let me let me bring the two black ones over that are left You got your choice of this one or this one. Let me see. Yeah. Or one of the white ones. Do you want to see the white ones or do you want one of these? White number one. Hang on a second. Let me bring the tray over so I can point at it to make sure we're getting the right one okay I lost my pen no there it is okay let me bring the tray over real quick is it this one right here Well, I'm making sure, okay, wait a minute. God, that looks all blown out. Sorry about that, y'all. Is it, this is number one. Would this be, this one, two, and three. So is that the one that you want? Okay, there we go. I will, <laughs> I'm trying to, well, I'm just gonna put this right here while these paintings sit and dry okay so let me move this so congratulations to my winners i have to come all the way over here to the other one because i can't read the chat on my other computer and I got all these bottles on the floor in my way so I want to thank you guys for coming out tonight um, oh thank you whoever handled that I couldn't get to Linda's comment quick enough um, and for those of you that came in late this is the colander pour I did that day and then this one is the um, magic wand. Although Brian likes to call it by something else. He calls it a sugar stick. Because <laughs> I'm not going to say the word. But if I say it's a, if he calls it, if I tell you he calls it a sugar stick, you'll know. Just substitute a different word. Or how about kitty stick? <laughs> anyway, so thank you guys for coming out. Don't forget, tomorrow night, 8 p.m. Eastern, is Brian. And um, Monday night is uh, Christina at 9 p.m. Eastern. And then um, Tuesday, I'll be back. Thursday... Um, and, um, let me see, yeah, Christina's Tutorials Thursday, uh, and then Saturday, you got Moose, then me, then right after me on this Saturday, um, is gonna be Darnell Shoemaker Arts First Auction, and I know that they've been, um, Wipe that blue fast off that painting. Oh, that's not a, that's not paint. <laughs> it's a piece of dried paint. <laughs> okay, so I love you guys. I'll see you all tomorrow night at Brian's Live. Brian's going to dazzle us with some artwork, okay? That's okay.
Okay, Ryan. I didn't know what you meant until I looked at my screen here. Anyway, so, you guys, thank you, thank you, thank you for coming out. I love you guys. And I will see you all tomorrow night. And thank you so much for everybody that came to see the Toy Masters Fluid Art collaboration today. And thank you to Brian, Christina, Shelly, Darnell, and Mona for allowing me to be part of that group. Everybody did such awesome artwork today. We showed them that we are Toy Masters. So all I can say is... Um, <laughs> Let me get over here to my other camera is bye for now oops wrong one there we go